How to make a paracord bracelet wide and less false without the buckles and with a stop knot. In the next few minutes, stay with us and you will learn how to make this beautiful, elegant paracord bracelet. Have fun and enjoy. Hello, my friends, welcome back. I hope that you're all well, safe, and sound, and that you're ready for yet another awesome paracord project. Today we're going to create this beautiful paracord bracelet without the buckle and the jig. The credit for today's project goes to our friend JD Lenson over the tie it all together. So check the description box down below where I post the link to JD's YouTube channel. As you can see, we're going to use the dark gray, the gold and the black paracord 550. Those two cords are the same length and this one is a bit shorter. So. First, if you want to learn how to make this beautiful paracord bracelet I am wearing today, the full tutorial how to make it you have in the top right corner in the information cards, also down below in the description box of this video. So that being said, we're gonna start. I'm gonna take the brown paracord first, pull it by the ends to find the center. Now when we find the center of brown, we're gonna cross it like this, one strand on top of the other. And then we're going to take our black paracord and also find the center of it, take the ends and pull it by the ends. And here we are. This is the center of our black. Now we're going to place the center of a black paracord on top of the crossed dark gray. So we have the right working end or right side working end and the left side working end. And we want to take the gold and find the center for gold paracord. As I said, we're going to take a gold and we're going to pull it through the loop we created with our dark gray all the way around. And now we're going to pass our ends through the gold cord loop. So from the top into the loop both ends and by doing this we're going to create the basic cow hitch so tight this eye or a loop will be the loop where we pull our stop knot on the end of this bracelet so as you can see here we have the dark gray base cords and uh, gold and the black working ends. So let's start. First, I'm going to pull this aside so you can clearly see. So we're going to take our dark gray and we're going to cross it again or once more like so. Now from here, we're going to take our black and we're going to pass it on top of the gray cord and then around and from the back we're gonna pull it through so basically the black cord goes from the top around and from the back to the left side of it as you can see now we're gonna take our gold cord or a gold strand sorry we have a lot of cords to work with it's a kind of messy on the beginning but later on it will be all neatly done. So we're going to take the uh, right, uh, right side of a gold and we're going to pass it on top of the gray around and from the back through again to the top. Now, as you can see, our gold paracord, actually, we're going to go around and to the right side of it. So the black will be on to the left of it and uh, gold onto the right. Now we're going to take the left side gold and we're going to make it around again. So to the back, around and from the back, through. And as you can see, this left side or left strand gold will be passing around and to the left side of this gold cord. 
now with the left side black so on top of the gray around and from the back through but to the right side of it and from here we're gonna simply tie it up cinch it and proceed as always the first few knots are the hardest one but later on when you have the structure for bracelet everything goes more smoothly and you have the neat structure of your project so we're gonna repeat we're gonna cross our dark gray one on top of the other and then we're gonna start with the right side black so on top of the gray around and from the back we're gonna return it through on the left side of the black paracord and now with the right side gold around and from the back through but on the this right this right side of a gold and with the left strand gold around and from the back through now the left side black around and from the back through the loop So from here we're gonna cut off the dark gray and we're gonna melt it down. Now we're going to take our black paracord and we're going to create the basic Salomon knot or a cobra knot. So the right side of a black cord on top of the gold cord, the left side on top of the right side black, around and from the back through the loop and pull it. Now we're going to singe it. Okay, now for the stop knot, 
we're gonna simply take our right side gold and we're gonna pass it on top of the two gold strands creating a little bite here and then we're gonna do the same with the left strand but we're gonna pass it under these two gold strands now we're gonna simply take this right strand and we're gonna pass it on top and through the loop on the left and with this left strand we're gonna pass it under and then through the loop of the right now we're gonna tie it So here we are, our today's project is finished, I hope that you like it. If you do, give a thumbs up, share this video with your friends and family, and if you're not subscribed, consider subscribing, and hit the bell button so you'll be notified whenever we post a new video. If you have any comments, uh, questions, suggestions, etc, feel free to leave a comment and we'll be get back to you as soon as possible. So until the next time. Stay safe, be well, wishing you just best, have fun and see you soon, bye!